Well, in breaking news, there are reports a Ukraine passenger plane has crashed near the Iranian capital. Iran State Television is reporting the aircraft went down after taking off from Tehran's international airport. At least 180 passengers and crew are believed to be on board the Boeing 737. Authorities have been quoted saying the crash was caused by a mechanical fault, but they have not elaborated. The crash came hours after Iran launched a ballistic missile attack targeting two bases in Iraq housing US forces. And Iran's foreign minister, we will bring you more details of course on that uh, civilian plane crash. Meanwhile, Iran's foreign minister claims its attacks on several US bases in Iraq were in self-defence. Iranian forces fired at least 15 ballistic missiles on at least two bases where US troops were positioned, including at Ain al-Assad and Taji. These attacks carried out, of course, in retaliation to the assassination of uh, the US carrying out this assassination on prominent Iranian General Qasem Soleimani. Foreign Minister Javad Zarif recently tweeted, Iran took and concluded proportionate measures in self-defence under Article 51 of the UN Charter targeting base, bases from which cowardly armed attacks against our citizens and senior officials were launched. We do not seek escalation or war, but will defend ourselves against any aggression. While US President Donald Trump tweeted, all is well. Missiles launched from Iran at two military bases located in Iraq. Assessment of casualties and damage is taking place now so far. So good. We have the most powerful and well-equipped military anywhere in the world by far. I'll be making a statement tomorrow morning.